Again? <laughs> I got something. Oh! Yep, I got something. And it's another halibut. I'm not so sure yet. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, this is a good one. <laughs> oh, good man. Yes, 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 oh, yes, this right. is the big one. Yeah, we might have to taste this, right? <laughs> yes. Well, that was, a, that was a good fish. It's a Canadian truck again. You see what he's trying to do is get me out of the action where he's continually hooking up halibut. And then I've got to clear my line and jump on the wheel when uh, all I want to do is catch one. Have you been out with friends and found that uh, you, you get into a day when uh, they catch everything and you don't? I'm having trouble moving this one. Yeah. This is my day at the moment, but the day is not over. Oh, I'm having trouble moving this one. Well, it might be a harpoon deal after all. Oh, look at the rod. Oh, wow. <laughs> there he goes. Wow. Yeah, that's a better fish, all right. Definitely, yeah. I see you're backing the drag down a little bit. You're getting a bit windy. <laughs> I just want to make sure that the tension's at the proper strength, you know? Hard on what the arms catch happens anything. with the guides is that if you're a first time angler and you're not really conversant with the gear, or even a second or third time, they'll actually hook them up like this, so you're effectively fishing two rods on your own, and then they'll pass the fish over. But uh, I've refused to take the other rod, so he's having a ball. <laughs> I can't wait to see this guy. Yeah, he's different. This is different, all right. He can feel the weed. Hey, this is just perfect, this weed drift and doing this. Here we go. There it is. Oh, yeah. You can, oh, act, wow. you can use the uh, gaff hook on this one, yeah. Gaff hook? Yeah. I guess. Oof, look at that. That's a. Look at the size of that. I'm going to step down here. Just kind of. Okay. Bring him in. <laughs> Fun begin. Rubber's belly. Remember, it said rubber's belly. That's right. Okay, rubber's belly. Rubber's belly. How many times? Seven. <laughs> well, eight. Hey, he yeah, slowed yeah. right down. Oh no, no! It worked! Oh yeah, nice halibut. Nice halibut. <laughs> it did too. Oh, yeah, of course it worked. We had one of the guys this morning <laughs> telling us that uh, the old native trick is to rub the belly seven or eight times and then they calm right down. But oh no way, that's an old fishing story if ever you heard one. Well there's the evidence. Thing leaps around, pats its belly, and that's it. Good night. <laughs> There you go, Graham. How's he look there, huh? Yeah, that's a big flounder, mate. <laughs> it's a very, very big flounder. Yes, sir. That's a fish, and it does feel quite heavy. It feels heavier than the other fish. Come on, wake up. Wake up and run, buddy. That's a fish, all right, mate. Wow, that just came in and just, whoa, yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah, that's doing hell of it like things, isn't it? I believe so. What kind of wheat you got on there? Oh, Can't not a huge amount. Much? I don't know. It's got a bit of wheat. Here, Here it comes. comes. It's a hell of it. It is a too, large trace on this, mate. Here you go. I want the guy. Yes, yes, thank sir. you. And that's my first halibut. Oh, excellent. Beauty. Thanks, mate. Yeah.